Today I'll be competing in a weekend raids event. Teams get points by obtaining unique items from any of the three raids. The rarer the item, the more points we gain. And to make things even spicier, there are bounties. Periodically throughout the event, specific challenges will be assigned. These vary from combat achievements to unique items from specific raid difficulties. The first team to complete the assigned bounties will receive extra points. Alright, I'm going to start off doing some solo cocks. I've not done any raids in a good while, so I want to freshen up before I start doing some group runs. I didn't have the shadow last time I actually needed to do solo cocks, as my final item was the twisted bow, so there is a few methods I will want to learn. But to start off with, I'm just going to learn the mage shadow method. I should be able to just carry across the full one from previously, so there's not going to be too much to learn. And from the looks of things, it doesn't seem the most difficult, but there's a chance I'm going to have to reset a few times just to get this sorted. So I still have a few remaining combat achievements from her. The only one I really have any interest in for solo is the sub-17. I actually still need to get that as I didn't really run for it previously and scouting was much more of an issue that I couldn't be bothered with. So once I'm a bit more comfortable with the shadow method, I'll try and scout a run for that and then that should go down pretty quickly. Oh. <laughs> I'm a fucking idiot. I think you can tell I'm a little rusty, right? Alright, we got there in the end. Alright, just before we go in, I need to revise a little bit beforehand again. From what I've seen, it doesn't seem too difficult, but I just need to get the rhythm going. Okay, let's head in. So my supplies are looking pretty bleak here. I don't think I'm going to get through this deathless at all, but I can give it a good go. So many frowls might help out a little bit. So I started off on the worst side. This side should be a bit easier to follow. Okay, let's see if we can get rhythm. First hit, good. Then two. Oh, I need to be doing long range here. Great. Okay, this is actually shocking. I don't think I'm going to be able to continue this without dying plenty of time, so I might as well just reset. <sighs> the problem I have is I, I need to be learning these new methods, but I at the same time I'm in a competition. It's not the most competitive competition, but still, I don't want to be completely dead weight. So, I mean, I'll come back to the, the, the cocks, but I think TOA will probably suit me a bit better at the moment. Uh, this should be a bit more consistent. And also, the drops are more common as well. Right, let's not make this as bad as the chambers, right? You get absolutely fucking railed and I'm not hitting. Very cool. There's so many throws. I think I'm going to have to bring ancients in just for this room, just until I get a bit more comfortable again. Yeah, uh, well, this is a this is a good start. At least it's the first room. All right, second time the charm. Let's get to fucking Baba now. How am I so fucking dog shit? All right, finally, it's fucking dead. Let's move on. All right, the rest of the bosses have gone smooth enough. Just need to deal with wardens now. All right, we got there in the end. Let's see if the first one pulls us a purple. Never lucky. Are you kidding this fuck? I'm stuck. <laughs> Sally up, bring Sally up. Time to give Cox another go. Let's see if we can do a bit better this time. This time around, I'm going to do a bit of prep because I actually do want to get the completions done. I am in a competition after all, and I do need the items, so even if it takes me a bit longer, it's worthwhile, and it will end up paying dividends in the future anyways. First chamber's completed, went through a bit more than expected, and of course, never lucky. And another one. Starting to get this mage method down now. This is the last one of the night now, this will be my ninth raid, I think. Once there's people around tomorrow to do some group runs, I'll start doing some TOAR. Chambers, hopefully get some challenge modes done actually. If I can get off the CM5's task, that would be really cool. Getting a bit sloppy out there, there, so it unfortunately did die. And of course, we got nothing. But uh, surely we should see some things coming in tomorrow in the teams. Just brushed up in a few more solos this morning. We are going to jump into some CM5's now. Of course, no unique shit. Get to like 90, 100. Yeah, like if you up, then we're just gonna take more damage and we might die. No, oh, you don't take that much damage. No, yeah, but we will. Like that. Yeah, yeah, right. 
Good luck. Chill, Good chill. luck. Never. Never, ever, ever, ever lucky. Ooh, the arrows. It's too close. <laughs> I saw you click through it. You like clicked through it, right? Uh, and ran towards it. Yeah, he was shooting that one out his ass. Holy, nearly fucking killed me there. Jesus Christ. Dry. Ooh. Oh, congrats. Hey, I think that's a tile yeah, or a bounty. It's the last one I need as well. A hundred more of those and we'll cash up. <laughs> Wait, you have three kits and 60 KC. 65, yeah. Friend of mine called Genix. He got his third kit on 850. What? Yeah, I got mine like, like, it was 500 or something. It was yeah. eight something, yeah. Yeah, we're having a bit of a break now. We've done we did a good few raids then. I'm gonna see if we can get the Akka Transmog, but I've not done this in a while, so I'm only gonna do a few attempts before we end up jumping into some more cocks. Just give it a go. I've decided to swap to Ancients now just to make this a bit easier. I don't need the throw damage, so I'd rather have the consistency and alongside the extra healing from the blood barrage, whilst I'm pretty bad. Alright, back to Chambers. I'm going to see if we can get this sub-17 now. I've scouted a decent layout, so this should be good enough. This is going to be interesting. I haven't actually done a rope skip on normals for fucking ages. I have no clue. Let's just see if this works. Great. I forgot to equip the necklace. <laughs> no way. Fucking hell. I'm so lucky. <laughs> Alright, heading into Ohm 7.25 with a Thieves Room. This should be plenty of time, really. Great. Fucking acid. I'm crumbling. And I've stolen my fucking cards on as well. <laughs> I promise I used to be better than this. I still Ohm 1850kc and I'm fucking awful still. No bruise. I've got two minutes. This should be fine. But I'm going to have to play it safe on the suicide. Oh. There we go, got there in the end. I hadn't bothered with any speedruns previously because the Twisted Bow was my last item. And when I did do raids, both wasn't even a thing then. So I could not be arsed resetting when I know eventually I'm going to get T-Bonus come back and do it anyway. So not the best time, but I've improved with the Shadow Method. So I'm happy with where I'm at. And it'll be good to come back in the future and get some nice times. Fuck that, I died like four times. I didn't deserve a T-Bow. Um, easy point. The guys are gonna give me a quick hand with the sub fourteen thirty time. This was one of the final trio times I need. Cox GM times are so funny. I'm in five minutes fifty in. I'm just like a random non non optimal layout. I don't think I've ever done like a good layout for these. <laughs> Nobody ever wants to fucking scout. <laughs> it, it is much nicer now, to be fair. Yeah, yeah, you just right click reload. That, that is really nice. I've set it. I've set the left stairs to left click reload. Yup. Oh, can even do that. It's kind of annoying if I want to actually leave. But I'm a I'm a fucking Billy Bob, right, dude? I don't do this raid. <laughs> right. The only way we don't get down now is if we are DC. You've got three and a half minutes, so I think you'll probably get it. Hope so. Nice. Surely a drop. TV's for all of us. Yeah. I think it's just you. Okay. Oh, when you killed the medics on your side. Yeah, adrenaline. I normally would for. 18 men, but... I'm terrified. <laughs> Don't move, be fine. 
What happened? Oh, I'm shit. Uh, I played Then he fucking made it without dying as well. And Justine was sorry. Four How on earth did we get 10 dead? My god. Like Pillars. Pillars. Run, 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 run. <laughs> no. Be mindful of, uh. Oh, wait. Never mind. Be mindful. I was like, this is awfully peaceful. Where did everyone go? <laughs> Why is no one Everybody over here? Why are you over there? I'm <laughs> by myself. I was Life like, what are these guys good. doing? Like, there's no way you're making it in time. I just didn't see shit. <laughs> I, <just don't... laughs> I must be fried. Fuck me. It happens. Funny. And now we're just... We hit. Was that eight people alive at the end? Holy! No, no. There's seven of us. Oh, I died. <clears throat> okay. Yeah. Um, surely, look. Surely. Oh my. Get the shadow. We only need five like more. Shadow? Good luck, shadow. Money, shadow. Oh. Oh. Yeah, buddy. Money ring. That was unfortunately the end of the raids event. We came in second, the team that came first got like four or five mega res across the weekend, alongside completing plenty of bounties. So there's no chance of catching up. But it was just a fun little event, had a good time, and I got a few combat teams knocked out. It was fun raiding with the boys. Haven't done any CM5s before, so definitely want to do more of them in the future. And that leaves us here now. I've got next to no Zora skills left, so I need to get a few items before Valamore releases in a few days. I still need the Magma Mutagen, the Jarrah Swamp, and the Pet. So I'm going to be doing that, and then if I do get a good amount of scales, I'll go back to Barrows. Hey. There we go. Got pretty lucky, got two uniques within 100 KC, so I'm going to head back to Barrows now. Unfortunately, I couldn't get the Magic Fang recorded. I've just lost the clip somewhere, but it's not that interesting. It's a duplicate anyway. So let's see if we can get a few more uniques from here quickly. Collection log slot completed. No, the duplicate. Collection log slot completed. Hey. I think that is actually a full set now. No, it looks like I just pretty much need one item from each set now. Collection log slot completed. Are you kidding? That leaves me with one item from each of the sets now to complete them. Fifteen hundred completed. Last Bow's chest before the Valamort date, I need to get this final elite clue done. And no unique. After finishing Barrows, I've got one item from each of the sets remaining, so not the best spot you'd want to be in if I would needed that full set for the master clue. Alright, I'm all prepped now for Valamort release. I'll be jumping straight into the Colosseum and locking myself there until I do complete it. If you haven't already, drop us a like, subscribe in a bit.